Hello, welcome to our class today. Today we're going to learn how to divide a line of a given length to an equal number of portions or parts. I have one example to help us understand. And in my question, you can read it so that divide the line AB of length 110 millimeters into eight equal parts. So, first of all, we're going to draw a line AB of length 110 millimeters. So, you can have your T square. Remember, T square is purposely meant to draw all horizontal lines. So, have a line, take your pair of compass, measure a length of 110. 110 millimeters. So, this is my 110. So, from my line. Sure you are perfect. So 110. So let me call it AB because the question tells me line AB and I'm dividing it to one and to eight equal parts. So this is the required line. Now when we're doing a division of a line, we'll have to construct we we'll draw another line of an of an angle, just desired angle from point A. So an angle of your wish here from point A. You can see mine that is. So this this is an angle of your of your wish. So we're going to divide or make equal acts here, equal length, uh, acts of equal lengths along this line, the line that we introduced. Remember, don't touch on AB. The line we're going to divide is AB, but we're going to have this line here, which we have introduced. Remember, it's of any angle, and we're going to make equal acts. So, just place your pair of compass to your desired length, like that. Make sure if you've chosen that length, you're not going to adjust it. So for my case, so we make equal X. Remember, I'm not adjusting my pair of compass. I'm not adjusting it. And we are dividing it to eight equal parts. So we'll have eight equal lengths of hex here. So that is five, six, Seven and eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I'm going to join point eight to point B. Eight to B. Now we're going to slide this line or rather have a line parallel to this passing each and every arc here cutting the length that we were given initially, A to B. So this is how we do it. So make sure one of your set squares is lying from the last point of division here to point B. You can look at mine. And you'll have another ruler here. Remember this one is fixed, but we'll be sliding this one along our line as we divide as that. So have that. So we're dividing our line by begun from point eight. Now I'm reducing them as I draw just the way you can see. I 
hope you're noting that the ruler at the base is not moving i'm simply sliding a ruler here so we've simply divided our line of length a b 110 to 8 equal parts we can count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 thank you for watching and please subscribe for our youtube channel and have a good day